Alright, this is 1026 Haverhill Road. It's a pretty decent neighborhood here. We have a church right next door. And it looks like, uh, looks like probably a park. Yeah, I think that's a park back there. Pretty, pretty big looking park there. Houses are pretty nice in the area. Um, there's townhouses over on that road. Uh, most of the houses are pretty good size on this road here. Our house here is on the smaller side for the houses on this road. See the roof. Roof looks okay. Let's see here. Shingles look a little bit old. They're not too bad. Well, the roof is nice and flat. I don't see any holes or anything. And then over here we have a parking space. So there's a, this fence line here. I believe this, this driveway is going to be our driveway. Uh, shingles over from this angle actually look a little better. Gutters, gutters look like they're in place. So yeah, like I said, the house is a little bit small. It's only two bed, one bath. Uh, no upstairs or basement, I believe. Here's some, looks like maybe some attic access here. Um, electric box is right here on the front. It's 100 amp box, it looks a bit old. Not too bad, but looks like it's been there for a little bit. Oh, this here we got the uh, gas meter thing. Looks like it's in decent shape. Uh, looks like all old wood windows on this in this room here. So we have this main like living room area, kitchen, kitchen dining right behind it, and then uh, some utilities off to the right. Bedroom on the back, bedroom over back behind there and a one bath. Um, there's drywall. Actually, it feels like it might be some kind of board. I'm not sure if that is drywall. That might be some kind of uh, thin board stuff. Uh, a little bit of texture on the ceiling. Uh, wood panels along the bottom. Trim looks mostly all right. A couple little missing spots there. Here's the kitchen. The kitchen cabinets look a little bit old. Pretty thin doors on them. Plumbing's all correct in there. Big wooden window on the side. Here's the one bathroom we have in the house. Tub looks fine. And we got ugly plastic around the shower here. Uh, sink cabinet looks a little bit old. Toilet looks all right. Toilet looks fine. Wood window. Drywall looks all right. Here's another attic access thing there. And um, we have a pretty bad hump in the floor here. It goes up that way. Um, it's pretty pretty uh, significant there. I probably have to try and be fixed by like maybe raising this part of the ground. I'm not sure. And then out here it seems the same. There's a bit of a hump going up into this hallway, kind of even with that thing. I think you can even see it there. Yep. Yeah, it's kind of kind of just like a bit of, bit of a hill in this center area here. Um, so then back on the back of the house here, we have one bedroom, two bedroom, and utility stuff over on this side. Water heater, it's a little bit small. Looks like it's in decent shape though. Let's see, I don't know, there's a little bit of rustiness down there. Uh, this pipe, this pipe is uh, split there. Going to the kitchen, I believe. Um, HVAC looks a bit old. Definitely looking kind of old there. Wood window. And here, one uh, one bedroom. This is drywall in here. Yep, 
Yeah, maybe it was drywall in the front room too. It seems like it's actually drywall all around. No trim, no trim on the floor in this room. Vinyl windows in here. A little bit thinner vinyl windows, but they look like they're fairly new and they look like they're in good shape. Except this one on the front is still wood, wood window. And then this uh, back bedroom here, which also has a door to the backyard. It's got one win wood window and two vinyl windows on it. The vinyl windows look good. But then this old wood window. A bit of a soft spot on the floor here. Um, drywall looks uh, pretty much fine. And then uh, oh, underneath of the house is kind of flooded. There's no basement, but there's whatever that is supposed to be underneath. Just like the foundation, it's got a looks like a good bit of water. You can see it from outside also. Here's the back. Decent sized backyard there. There's the driveway up front. Kind of lines up with this back thing here if you wanted to extend the driveway. Church over to the side here. It's a bit muddy. Kind of muddy back here. Shed and dog kennel. Kind of grown in place dog kennel there. All right, that's it. Siding is a little bit mismatched here and there. Yep, all right, that's it.